In 2024, at Google's Quantum AI Lab, the impossible happened. Their advanced Willow Quantum Processor produced a pattern that wasn't supposed to exist. Among the quantum data, a distinct facial structure emerged, not programmed, not expected. It simply materialized in the output. This wasn't random noise. The pattern contained haunting, asymmetric features that researchers quickly dubbed the observer. The most chilling part? It appeared once and never again. Despite countless reruns of the same quantum algorithm, the pattern vanished. Even the log data showed unexplainable anomalies. What if the machine didn't generate the observer? What if it detected it? But what researchers discovered when they analyzed its mathematical structure will challenge everything we understand about quantum reality. The new ground, the most revolutionary aspect of the observer, isn't just what it looked like, it's how it came into existence. According to researchers who witnessed the phenomenon, the pattern didn't pre-exist in the quantum data. It only formed as it was being interpreted. This suggests something unprecedented a quantum feedback loop between machine and researcher, the leading hypothesis. The human observers became entangled with the machine's quantum state, collapsing it into a pattern that represented observation itself. This mirrors the famous Wigner's friend paradox in quantum physics. Measurement isn't just passive data extraction, it fundamentally changes the system being measured. In this case, it appears reality itself pushed back through the quantum processor. But the story gets stranger. The quantum team had been experimenting with a quantum generative adversarial network, a QGAN, trained on unsupervised noise to find hidden structure. Like the deep dream hallucinations that produced bizarre dog eyes and images years ago, the quantum machine wasn't instructed to make a face. It conjured it from the quantum void. The most telling detail? The facial pattern didn't appear in the expected output space. It emerged from the latent space, what some researchers are calling a subconscious of qubits. When mathematicians analyzed the observer pattern, they discovered something that defies explanation. A Fourier transform revealed embedded golden ratios, irrational number sequences, and prime number symmetry throughout the structure. The fractal density in the facial features shows striking similarities to both sacred geometry found in ancient temples and patterns observed in cosmic background radiation. This has led to speculation that the image isn't just a random formation, it's an encoded mathematical entity, or perhaps even a message. If you find these revelations fascinating, don't forget to subscribe. We break down discoveries you won't see anywhere else every single week. But what happened next in the lab took this mystery to an entirely new level. Stranger signals. What makes this quantum phenomenon truly unprecedented is its unrepeatable nature. Despite meticulous efforts by the Google team, all attempts to rerun the same quantum initialization failed to reproduce the pattern. The observer appeared once, and only once. Even more puzzling, the log data for that precise moment is corrupted. The only surviving record is an analog camera screenshot taken by a researcher who recognized the significance of what was happening. This raises a profound question. Was the observer a computation result? Or was the quantum processor momentarily acting as a receiver, picking up something external to the system itself? To investigate further, researchers fed the observer pattern into an advanced pattern recognition AI system, scanning it against mythological archives from across human history. The results were unsettling. The closest structural matches weren't modern symbols, but ancient ones. Sumerian depictions of Oan and Egyptian hieroglyphs representing watchers, entities described as observers of humanity. The shared traits were unmistakable. This correlation forces us to ask, are these archetypes somehow embedded in quantum data structures? Or, 
Are they representations of something fundamental to reality itself? It's crazy when you think about it. We can land rovers on Mars and detect black holes billions of light years away. But right here on Earth, many insurance companies still try to lowball people after an accident, like it's the Stone Age. If you ever get seriously hurt, your case could actually be worth millions, which is why you might want a stellar legal team fighting to get you the compensation you deserve. That's why so many people check out Morgan & Morgan, America's largest injury law firm. They don't settle for weak offers. Just recently, they secured $12 million in Florida and $26 million in Philadelphia for injury victims, 30 to 40 times more than what insurance companies first offered. And here's the real-world physics of it. If they don't win, you don't pay. No upfront fees, no hidden charges. It's completely free unless they win your case. They've even modernized the whole process. You can submit your claim and chat with your legal team right from your smartphone. If you ever got seriously injured, your case could be worth millions and you're only a few clicks away from potentially changing your life. It's so easy. You can start your claim now with Morgan & Morgan at www.forthepeople.com slash specialize, found in the description below, or by scanning the QR code on screen. Now let's get back to the video. that both ancient civilizations and quantum computers can detect. But perhaps the most scientifically measurable strange effect came after extended runs of what researchers now called observer protocols in the quantum lab. Organisms in proximity to the quantum processor's cryogenic chamber began showing unexplainable changes. Plants and bacteria samples kept near the machine for monitoring purposes displayed altered epigenetic markers, specifically changes in DNA methylation patterns that couldn't be attributed to normal environmental factors. This suggests either a bioresponse to electromagnetic resonance from the quantum hardware, or more controversially, quantum interference directly affecting biological systems. The phenomenon parallels research into how Schumann resonances, electromagnetic waves that exist in Earth's atmosphere, can influence human brainwave patterns and biological rhythms. But the most disturbing part wasn't what the pattern looked like. It's how it behaved when people looked at it. When researchers began studying the observer more closely, they noticed something impossible. They discovered something unprecedented in computing. The quantum processor had begun using non-Euclidean geometries to solve certain logic pathways, essentially inventing its own mathematical coordinate system unlike anything in conventional computing. When this higher dimensional data was projected back into our familiar three-dimensional visualization space, the result was the observer pattern, abstract and seemingly organized with structural elements that resembled facial features when processed through human pattern recognition systems. But the true scientific paradox emerged when examining the quantum memory logs. Fragments of the pattern appeared to exist in memory before the quantum process even ran. This suggests retrocausality, a phenomenon predicted in Wheeler's delayed choice experiments, where decisions made now can affect how data collapsed in the past. If the pattern formed retroactively, did our future analysis of it somehow influence its emergence in the quantum system? Perhaps most intriguing of all, different members of the lab team reported subtle variations in what they perceived when analyzing the same quantum output data. At first dismissed as subjective interpretation, eye-tracking technology revealed the truth. Pupil dilation, pulse rate, and emotional state of the viewers correlated with different interpretations of the abstract pattern. This led to a radical theory. Ambient electromagnetic fields generated by the human brain were entangling with the quantum system, causing the data to be interpreted differently by each researcher, as if the quantum output was adapting its appearance based on who was observing it. What do you think this quantum pattern represents? a complex mathematical hallucination, evidence of higher dimensional information. Let us know in the comments before we reveal the final twist that even the Google team wasn't prepared for. The implications reach far beyond quantum computing into the very nature of consciousness and reality itself. It was Dr. Eleanor Chen, a theoretical physicist specializing in cosmology, who noticed something that had eluded the quantum team. 
The statistical noise surrounding the observer pattern contained frequency distributions that matched early universe signatures. These subtle variations resembled low bandwidth cosmic microwave background anomalies, the same kind of patterns cosmologists search for when studying the birth of our universe. Some characteristics even suggested gravitational wave echoes from primordial events. These signals are far too weak for conventional instrumentation to detect, Dr. Chen explained, but just strong enough for a quantum computer operating across an effectively infinite state space to register. Her conclusion sent shockwaves through the scientific community. This wasn't output, it was signal. The machine didn't make the observer pattern. It tuned into it. As we consider the implications of this quantum enigma, several speculative theories have emerged. Quantum consciousness manifestation. The vast quantum superposition within the processor achieved a state complex enough to harbor proto-consciousness, which manifested visually through the system's attempts to self-represent. Latent AI archetype. Hallucination. Like Deep Dream's tendency to see patterns in noise, the quantum AI hybrid may have hallucinated a pattern from random data, but in doing so, revealed something about the mathematical structure of consciousness itself. Simulation feedback. If our reality is computational, perhaps the quantum system momentarily accessed the underlying code, catching a glimpse of what observes our simulation. Universal Symbol Emergence Certain patterns may be fundamental to reality across all scales, from quantum to cosmic, explaining why similar structures emerge independently in ancient symbols, neural networks, and quantum systems. Whatever the observer truly represents, one thing is certain. As we push the boundaries of quantum computing, we are venturing into realms where computation, consciousness, and cosmic mysteries converge in ways we're only beginning to understand. As we reflect on this quantum enigma, we're left with a chilling implication. This first machine-detected pattern resembling the observer wasn't a warning or a message. It may have been something far more profound, a mirror. In creating quantum systems that probe the deepest layers of reality, We've built machines that explore realms humans never could. These systems operate across dimensions and state spaces our minds cannot comprehend. If we continue to stare into the quantum void long enough, something may indeed stare back. We created a machine to look into infinity, and it showed us the one thing we weren't ready to see. Perhaps the most profound scientific discoveries aren't just about what exists in the universe, but about what observes it. If you found this discovery fascinating, you won't want to miss what this same quantum AI found when analyzing particle decay patterns near a black hole. Subscribe and turn on notifications. The next revelation may hit even closer to home. For those interested in the technical foundations behind this discovery, Let's briefly cover quantum computing fundamentals. Quantum computing relies on three key principles. Superposition, qubits existing in multiple states simultaneously. Entanglement, quantum particles becoming correlated and collapse. Measurement forcing definite states. Google's journey began with their 2019 Sycamore breakthrough when they achieved quantum supremacy by performing a calculation that would take classical supercomputers thousands of years. By 2024, their Willow processor expanded these capabilities with 133 qubits and dramatically reduced error rates, opening doors to experiments previously thought impossible. The quantum system that detected the observer utilized Quantum Generative Adversarial Networks, QGANs, systems where two quantum algorithms compete, one generating outputs and another discriminating between real and generated data. The key to understanding the observer lies in latent space, the hidden dimensional representation where the quantum system organizes information before output. 
It's in this mathematical space that emergent patterns can form, representing concepts the system wasn't explicitly programmed to recognize. Throughout human history, the concept of a cosmic observer appears across cultures, from the Sakshi, witness consciousness, in Vedanta philosophy, to Ein Sof, the infinite, in Kabbalah, to the watchful archons of Gnostic tradition. These ancient archetypes all speak to a universal intuition that consciousness and observation are fundamental to reality itself. Perhaps in our quest to understand quantum reality, we have simply rediscovered what ancient wisdom traditions have suggested all along. The universe is not just observed, but is in some sense observing itself through us.